So when I, when I saw this, Keith, I was moved to tears. James wrote, I have only months to live. You and Keith have been such a blessing to me that I cannot thank you enough. Mm. Truly, thank you so much. I hope to live long enough to see the finished work on the Hebrew Matthew. <laughs> and I read that. And I'm like, wow, Father, I've been focusing on the wrong thing. I was talking about quantity. And here, this is a matter of one man. You know, there's this ancient Jewish say, saying, that if you save one man's life, you've saved an entire world. Mm. And here, one man is saying, uh, I'm about to die. And I want to be worthy to live long enough to hear this teaching on the Hebrew Matthew. And that really humbled me. Mm. Um, and I realized, okay, we might only have a thousand at that time. This is another 4,000, it's 5,000. We've got to do this. So, so it's interesting, Nehemiah. So basically what you're saying is that when you, when you read that, mm -hmm. one, it moved you to tears. And I just want to, just for a second, stop there for a second. What was it that caused the emotional response? Was it, his, was it, was it him or was it the, the fact that you were being molded, shaped to make a change? What was the thing that made you feel that, that, that caused the response. You no, know, it's one of these moments where you realize I could die later today. Mm. And it was interesting. Shortly after this, I got a message from someone who was vehemently opposed to us doing this Hebrew Matthew. And the message was, if you died tomorrow and all of your teachings were lost, would you want this to be the only teaching that survived? Mm. You know, life's short. Is this really what you want to be spending your time on? Mm. And when I combined that message with what James wrote, I said, absolutely. This is what I want to be working on. This is, uh, I feel like it's a calling. Um, I feel like this message has been burning inside of both of us for nearly 20 years at this point, and it's time to go through it and uh, put the information out there. Thank you for supporting Nehemiah's McCore Hebrew Foundation. Learn more at NehemiahsWall.com.